Good afternoon, this is Nshaman Oracle reading for Wednesday, December the 14th, 2022. And today I'm reading for Libra, Scorpio and Sagittarius. And the reading starts with Libra. Hello Libra, I hope you had a good day so far. And hopefully a better day than myself, because here today it's snowing like crazy. And the roads are very icy and dangerous. And we were even warned to stay inside today because of the weather conditions. But I had to go out this morning to work, but nothing happened. I came home, no things broken, no leg broken, no arm broken. Thanks for that. So, Libra, four cards for your reading. Starseed Oracle, Priestess of Light, Work Your Light Oracle and goddess power and the reading starts with star seed oracle called earth and earth relate to learning how to be human and to be in the world but not of it the challenge for all souls having a human experience is to be in the world but not of it to realize they are souls having a human experience and so be fully conscious of it. People's personalities tend to relate to either transcendence or immanence and those who lean toward transcendence, they have a longing for the heavens and the metaphysical and they often yearn for a personal experience with God and to be lost in the heavens. They are envisioning angels and they are more comfortable praying and hanging out in the stars rather than here on earth. And those who tend toward immanence, they have attached themselves more to the earth and to the bodily. They spend more time thinking about things in this physical world rather than connecting with the heavens or their own mystical inner world. Being a fully embodied soul, having a human experience means finding the balance between transcendence and immanence and being in the world but not of it. Most star seeds are drawn toward transcendence. They are more comfortable with the angels and the heavens. Life on earth can be more difficult for them. So if this is you, Libra, you are being reminded that you chose to be a soul in a body on earth. And you are being called to focus more of your energies in the physical world and to learn how to be human. And also... To realize that a soul in a human body is that one which relates to the life on earth and you have to find out what that means for you. Ask yourself, do you tend to long for the stars or be more in the physical world? How can you find greater balance between the two? Next card is called Innovation and this Innovation card is from the Priestess of Light Oracle and Innovation relates to new creations and the Priestess of the Mind extends her hands upward on the card and the light from her palms sending two hawks flying in opposite directions. Beautiful golden orbs hover over and around her head, marking a time of great confidence and mental activity for you, Libra. You are being guided by spirit to explore new directions of invention and creation. Your invention may come in the form of a wide variety of endeavors 
such as Inu Business, a medical discovery, a new computer game, or the founding of a charitable agency. Anything from a musical composition to a real estate development could be among the types of innovations springing to your mind at this time. You may even be thinking about going to school again for a special degree or some kind of a certification. If so, know that you are certainly capable of achieving it. You may find yourself conflicted as you consider two very different paths, both brimming with potential. The hawks, birds of prey and war, they represent the inner battle regarding your choices. But your confusion is only preventing you from taking action in either direction. A nagging voice of self-doubt may be keeping you on the fence. But note how the priestess's heart center glows with confidence. This card is saying that you now have, have the power to make a decision and see it through. Trust in yourself and let yourself receive the guidance and information all around you. Your mind is sparking with the lights of new ideas. Listen to your heart about which path to follow. Say this affirmation, Libra. I open my mind to the pipeline of new ideas available to me now. I know I am capable to follow through. Again, I open my mind to the pipeline of new ideas available to me now. I know I am capable to follow through. Last time, I open my mind to the pipeline of new ideas available to me now. I know I am capable to follow through. Next card is called play and the play card comes from the work your light oracle and the play card is an action card this deck has different categories for the cards like confirmation inquiry activation action and transmission and the card play is a so-called action card relating to having fun, celebrate, and don't be so serious. Stop taking life so seriously. Your spirit needs to have some fun. The more you play, the more inspiration will follow. Take some time out to do something without being attached to the outcome. You are being called to rest and play, and learn to have more fun. Do something that makes you laugh. It's the best medicine that you can wish for. Call up a friend that you can be silly with. Take your inner child on a date. The more you switch off your mind, the more room your spirit has to whisper and to guide you. When we do things without being attached to the outcome, ideas, clarity, guidance, then solutions have the space to drop in. The left and right hemispheres of the brain can begin talking to each other. Make play a compulsory part of your day. Schedule it. Spend more time doing things just because you love to do them. Just because they bring you joy and light you up. If you follow what lights you up, you will light up the world without even trying. For when we are lit up, we are in the spirit 
and then we fall into the flow of life. Ask yourself, how do I play? What do I have to do to have fun? What lights me up? If you have been working hard lately, it's time to celebrate how far you have come, all that you have achieved. Don't rush on to the next thing. Take a moment to throw a party, go on vacation or have some more fun. So have more fun, play more and celebrate your achievements. That sounds good, Libra. Do that. Have fun and laughter in your life. Okay? Last card is the Priestess of Light Oracle. And the card that came out for you. No, what do I am saying? Not the Priestess of Light. The last card is the Goddess Power card. The Goddess Power card. And the card that came out. The Goddess came out. Her name is. Brenwen. And Brenwen stands for forgiveness. And the empowerment message is sometimes life invites us into conditions that challenge us to the core. As the Celtic goddess Brenwen forgave those who caused her own death by a broken heart. She asks you to set yourself free from the seeds of resentment that will surely choke the life out of your dreams. We are wounded by others and we weave stories about our hurts and losses that live on in our hearts and minds. We come to distrust the potential of love and connection. No matter what your story or when it began, forgiveness is the key to freedom here. Forgiveness allows for mending and for repair and opening the heart to give and to receive. If you need to forgive yourself or others, now is the time to do it. Keep your heart open and you can begin again. Only beauty, freedom and treasures are found in the spirit of forgiveness. The goddess Brenwen is here to support you. There is an alignment message. Sometimes we unintentionally cause hurt or pain to others. And sometimes our motive really is to hurt. Now is the time for self-inventory and making amends. Your alignment task is to be 100% accountable for your thoughts, feelings, beliefs, motives and actions. You are not doing this, however, to experience forgiveness from someone else or even from yourself. It is to have the strength and fortitude to be accountable and take responsibility for your actions. And in this way, neither guilt nor shame can take root in your heart. You stand empowered and humble with your head high, no matter the consequences. You will always be the beneficiary of such an act. The goddess Brenwen says deep healing comes from this kind of courage and respect. That was your reading Libra. Have a wonderful afternoon. Take care and goodbye.